open the head of q switch and the arc laser and we have found that during its operation the energy energy is practically zero and we have noticed after removal of, of this tip of this QC and the arc that there is some drop of the water so i have opened the head of this QCHIC and the arc probe and we just clean all the water and we have checked there is something inside the water tubes so the, there is partial blockage of the water flow also otherwise every connection of this tube is normal and we have cleaned the water from inside here right so we have cleaned the water and now I will reassemble, I will open the silicon tube to clear all the obstruction. This I have cleaned. Now I am going to cut the zip tie. We will clean all the obstruction inside the tube. And after assembling we will check well whether the energy comes out normal or not. Zip tie to clean the water from this tube was blocked now connect it again mm -hmm. now again we can notice that there is something is sticking here see so these are responsible for now now this is clean the damaged part of the silicon tube here now I am applying the zip tie to hold in place and now we are fixing the probe it's all right now Now there is no leakage of water, everything is okay now, we will test it. Serviced and clean this tube. This, this unit is for controlling the q switch and the arc. This one and this capacitor is again of q switch and the arc. Now the other one, the tall capacitor, these two big capacitor and this control, this control is for the intense pulse light, right. Now on the lower down, if I see, there is a condenser there, here, in this area. This is a, this is the, in fact, water cooler here, fan is there and the radiator is there. This is the water, white is a water. This is water tank. And here, this control mechanism, there is a solenoid wall solenoid valve is here and two wire connection comes one from uh, the q switch nd arc touch board and another is from the intense pulse light touch board so this cooling is again the same common container water container and and of course the radiator here so again i am repeating this unit is this unit is for the q switch nd arc and the lower down two big capacitors and the control unit pcb board is for the intense pulse light and the third the small unit is for the for the radio frequency so now i will fill up the tank we will change exchange the water we will see after opening the door everything is all right there is so there should not be any leak then i will try all the two probes